What is up everybody? King Num Num here, bringing you guys some Misa gameplay in ranked. Now in this match we will be going against an S badge Axe Boy on Leo's memory. I will be playing Mechanic, obviously that's who got the Death Note collaboration crossover skin. Um, I was pretty pissed off because I think Perfumer deserved it. However, I'm not going to complain, you know, because I use a Mechanic a little bit. I've been um, trying to work on her as best as I can, you guys, because... Unfortunately, I wasn't a huge mechanic main due to her endgame being so bad. However, they did balance her a tiny bit with her endgame making it better and her early game a little bit worse. Just to, you know, ju just to make her more balanced. She's still broken in my opinion, obviously. However, it is what it is. At this point, Hunter is going to end up finding me due to the target um, fireball, whatever you like to call it. Keep in mind, team comp is looking pretty good. However, Cypher Rush will be slow if I get found early like I did. Keep in mind, I'm just going to abuse Factory. Um, I think one of the biggest mistakes this Axe Boy made in this match was just, I don't know if he's rusty or not, but I think he accidentally teleported to the wrong Cypher, as you're going to see here. I'm assuming he wanted to teleport straight into Factory, end up teleporting all the way to Christmas Tree Gate, and I feel so bad, because little things like this will literally throw the match, as you're going to see. Um, this actually happened to me, unfortunately, when I was playing Hunter when I first came back. Um, end up just throwing my like just throwing everything made me pretty pissed off maybe just want to stop playing hunter but i kept going you know reach cyclops if you guys didn't see on the community post but you're gonna see me hide my bot why am i hiding it i know he's gonna find it but i'm giving it time so he's like oh shit where'd it go i mean he probably already saw it anyways that's besides the point i'm not a huge mechanic man but i am still learning so keep in mind that okay so i'm gonna hide it right behind this barrel i know the hunter's gonna be in my ass like white on rice and ford's gonna harass as best as he can now, Ford did make a couple mistakes in this match, just like me, so I'm going to point it out. But, um, out of probably all the randoms I've gotten, this Ford has definitely showed up. Like, he was B-Badge right when Andy came out, at least when I noticed, because I was grinding right consistently. And I think he's, like, A-Badge 50 and below right now. You know, he's grinding, okay, y'all? He's motherfucking grinding. You see that the Hunter does have confined space, but I already assumed that for how fast he breaks pallets. End up swinging there, unfortunate, because I ended up bolting way too early than he expected. Also got my speed boost back in time, so... You're gonna see that Ford ended up actually hitting an amazing stun. Um, I didn't get to show you guys because I switched to it too late. That shit's besides the point, though. Now, you're just gonna see me loop here and just mind game the Hunter. I don't know how I dodged that shit, dog. I didn't even look, but that's besides the point. Looking a little laggy here. Sorry about that, you guys, but... Yeah, you're just going to see me play just play with his head a little bit. You're going to see the Ford actually come in for a stun right here, which is actually really unnecessary. Ends up actually missing it as well. Um, but the Hunter's not going to chase him. Hunter's like, nah. Mechanic, I want that ass, okay? You're wearing Misa, and I'm pissed off, okay? I think Misa on um, Mechanic does look cute. Like I said, I wish it was Perfumer, but I'm not going to complain. You do see I do have the accessory as well with the pet, pet to match, okay? Tell me I don't got drip, uh. Now you see the Ford is getting healed up by the Wildling. A lot of the times a Wildling brings a healing build as well. At this point, I'm just going to keep keeping him in this pattern. So he's going to walk straight through the pallet. Boom, and a pallet stunning him. It's all about mind games, you guys, a lot of the time against a lot of hunters. Um, people like BQ and shit, though, and Dream Witch. It's kind of hard to do it. But it is what it is. You're going to see Axe Boy hit an amazing fireball to show that he is S-Badge. Amazing fireball right there. However, there's already three ciphers left. Keep in mind, my bot that was dropped over at Shitty Corner, that cipher is about 60-70%, okay? So in this gameplay, I'm pretty sure we end up working on six six total ciphers that are almost prime. Um, anyways, that's besides the point. You're going to see me get hit like it's free real estate out here. God damn! Nice fireball, though. You're going to see me end up trying to take my bot to Shitty Corner. Um, end up actually going basement as well, so amazing job by the hunter. However, 4 is going to do something a little goofy. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. I personally don't recommend it because Mechanic needs to decode while she's on the chair. But you're going to see him immediately just going for the stun. He doesn't want to risk him getting stuffed after that kite. Which, that shit kind of pissed me off. I'm not going to lie to you guys because I'm trying to decode, okay? And then he don't even body block for me? I'm in pain. Uh, I'm in Spain without the S, y'all. Anyways, you see one Cypher at 50, other one at 90. So Wildling's actually going to come in for the next rescue. Um, if this doesn't look like a three-man, I don't know what is. Like, let's be real here. Um, he's not going to be able to chair me in basement because I end up taking that speed boost, trying to push as far away as I can. Keep in mind, I'm paying attention to the toy merchant pings, and I'm like, I don't need to work on shitty corner. I could just take my bot to gate. So you're going to see that's what I'm going to do. 
You're going to see Ford wanting to go in for the rescue. However, Wildling's like, nah, I got this. You got wanted. Let me do it. See the Cypher's Prime right there. And yeah, you're just going to see him come in. Amazing job by this Wildling, you guys. And you'll see what I'm talking about. You're going to see an amazing dodge right here with the Fireball. Being baited his ass. You're going to see him get him into this pattern of, I'm going to rescue. This is what I'm going to do. Boop. Boop. And he's going to fake like he's doing it again. Hunter's going to swing. You see? At this point, I'm going to make a pivotal mistake, you guys. And this is why I like looking back at my gameplay. And I will be looking at your guys as soon. Um, I actually vault like a dumbass and get terror shock. You see there? Boop. And I tell him to pop it. And I'm going to instantly go down. I feel like a complete dumbass. End up opening the gate with my bot. I go down. But other than that, you guys, it will be a three-man. If you did enjoy Misa gameplay, please let me know in that comment section below. I will be bringing her back if you want to see more. Other than that, you guys, you already know the vibe. I'm Numer, and I'm out.